Hi, so I thought I would show you a um, shower scrub that I've been making for myself. Um, it only has two ingredients, so it's really um, easy to make. And um, it also is quite a good way of using up coffee if you've got um, left, uh, grounds left in a packet and you don't really want to drink them anymore. So the first thing that you do is melt some coconut oil. Um, and that's on my double boiler over there. I just use this one from Costco which is organic and cold pressed, blah, 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 blah. Um, it's just the one that I use for everything, cooking and, um, yeah, everything. And I've got this coffee, when we went on holiday last year, we bought it in Lidl, I think it was, and um, we didn't end up drinking it all. And I was trying to think of what to do with it, to use it up, because it was, um, well, it's just... In my fridge doing nothing so um, you could use any kind and you can change the you can get it ground at places like Starbucks where you can buy the coffee from them and then they grind it how um, bigger grains you want it to be so this is probably about medium and the reason I'm measuring it is because I want an equal volume of coffee to coconut oil so I'm finishing off the packet so this is my melted coconut oil and um, yeah so I just melted it there so it's all ready and then you actually I can use this coconut spoon so you just mix them in a bowl together and it's, that's just to combine it because the coffee can be a bit lumpy and then you've got this kind of gloopy brown muddy looking stuff and then I've lined um, a muffin pan with these silicon moulds. I tried doing it just with uh, no mould and they're really hard to get out. If you had a muffin pan that's made of silicon that you can push them out, you wouldn't need to use these. But I've just used these um, so that they're easy to get in and out. You could use paper ones, but the coconut oil will seep into the paper and um, make them quite greasy. Whereas these, um, you can store them quite easily and I leave them in the in the things to store. So all I do is take a measure of this and I fill them about halfway because well you can you can make them any size you like so you, I have made miniature ones but I prefer bigger ones and then each one is a single shower um, and if you wanted you could add things like essential oils and um, even if you had leftover almond um, grounds from making almond milk you could do you could use them in that so they're ready to go I'll just show you that they're ready to go in the fridge and I'll show you what they look like later so I thought I would show you what the um what they look like once they're finished so I keep mine in the fridge so that they stay hard even in the summer and you can see the uh, coconut oil has gone all hard and all you do is you can pop them when you want to go for a shower, pop them out, and they're really hard. And then you can just use them as a scrub all over your body. And I find one about that size does the whole of me. I forgot to mention about the scrubs um, in the main part of the video. When you use them, um, they make your shower quite messy because obviously it's ground coffee. So if you really don't like your shower getting dirty, um, best not to use them. But if you do, um, use them. You just need to um, put the shower, um, rinse off the coffee grounds before you get out the shower. Um, we've got a hard shower door so it's easy to rinse that off. So I don't know what it's like if you've got a shower curtain but I just thought I'd warn you. 